Hi everyone, it's Kristen. Um, okay, so fourth day in a row. I'm pretty sure you guys are probably getting sick of my videos by now, but I wanted to do a quick um, face of the day. One of my subscribers, um, Carol is her name, wanted to see how I use the Prelude Quad. So I thought I would show you guys that, um, but I'll show you my whole, you know, the whole face, the whole ordeal. Um, <clears throat> I kind of ran the price range gamut today from one end to the other. So I'll kind of show you all over my face today. And on Thursdays, I golf in a golf league, which is not going so well this year, just for, you know, your information. But anyway, so I have a long day. So I use the Remo Lasting Finish. My color is 25, no, <laughs> it's 25 hours. Uh, my color is 103 True Ivory. I really like that. It really does stay forever. I don't know about 25 hours because I've never tested that, but. Um, and I set it with um, Mally Pore Perfect. I forgot to bring that out, but I'll show that another day. But the Mally powder stuff with a little bit of color. Um, I used, <laughs> see what I mean about the price range? A Chanel blush. <laughs> that one, I love this blush. I think it's so pretty. Oh, wait. And I, it's, you're supposed to cover the mirror so people don't get blinded. And this is in Tweed Fuchsia. Um, oh, and I was going to show you guys. The, the brush that I use with the Remo Lasting Finish is the Real Techniques Stippling Brush, which is sturdy because I just used it. Um, but I really like this. It's really dense. It works better than 187 in my opinion. Um, I used 129 for blush. Oh, and yeah, it was my MAC one this time. Um, and then I used, this is the, the bronzer I was using before the e.l.f. bronzer is my um, NARS Laguna. Just that color, as you can see, I've used it. Um, with my Sigma F20. Just that, I don't know if I really showed you guys in the video, but this is, it's like a flat, like a paddle brush. Not so much like as actually a paddle brush. Um, okay, I use the Too Faced Shadow Insurance Primer today. I used, oh, back to my face, I used the Milani um, Advanced HD Advanced Concealer again. I don't know if you guys really care about that, but, you know, whatever. Um, today for my brows, I used the Maybelline Define a Brow. This is what I was using forever and was my holy grail before that um, Your Best Friend one came in my birch box last month. I described this one today for some reason. No idea why. Um, okay, on to the Prelude Quad. I'll show you what I, the colors and where I use them. Huh, hold on. <laughs> and where I use them. And then um, I'll zoom you guys in so you can see. So the Prelude Quad came out just uh, a couple months ago. Um, and it is like taupe, taupes, but they tend to wear, in my opinion, at least on me, a little more gray than they do taupe. Um, but there are the colors. It's, it is really very pretty. Um, so those are the colors. I'll zoom you in here. Okay. So, I used this one. Let me see if I can show you this. This one right here, all over my lid. Then I used this one in the crease. I used this one as a highlight. And then I also went back over it on my, on my lid after I did the crease because I felt like it was a little bit dark, so I wanted to brighten it up a little bit. And then I used this one here, just in the outer corner. I'm not sure if you can, oops. And then I used the Chiang Mai, I'll put you guys back out. I used the Chiang Mai liner, over and under. And then I, smudged out the Chiang Mai under anyway, I left it alone um, with that darker color again, this one, um, underneath the lash line. 
And I, again, I don't know that anybody's interested, but I use the 239 for the all over lid color. I used my Sigma F, no, E25 for the crease color. Um, I used, this is an Essence of Beauty. There, there were two of them that came in a pack, one a little bit bigger than the other. This is a little bit bigger one. Um, I used that to place the color in the outer corner and then I blended it out with my E25. Um, I blended the outside edges and put on my highlighter with my um, this is Smashbox crease brush number 10. I really like this brush. It's kind of like the 224. Um, smudged my liner on my upper line with my 266 from MAC. Then of course this is the pencil brush 219 from MAC that I used underneath. And then I tried the blank mascara today and while I don't hate it and I don't dislike it um, it I guess it added a little bit of length but I didn't let's look again shall we I it doesn't give me the volume that I usually like I don't have a ton of lashes I don't feel like so I try to do use a thickening like that elf one that's a little bit more thickening but okay and then I use the Mac lip liner and sore just all lined in all over my lips and then I went over top of it and this is a brand that does not get enough love I mean there are more skincare things I guess I don't know from this blend, brand than makeup but this is by Aveda we have a Veda salon in our little town which is amazing we actually have two um, and this is in sugar plum that's real pretty it's good pigmentation for gloss I really like these and they're all natural products Okay, so that is that. I'm going to try to show you, since it's a little bit different, I'll do a little outfit of the day. Without getting lip gloss over myself. Um, okay, so this is a real thin kind of sweater looking thing. You take this down a little bit. I'm actually wearing a skirt today, which rarely happens. This is a real fun little skirt. I've had it for a long time. I just got it back from... Um, I had it taken in. Um, I don't know if you can see, but it's got a little ruffle detailing on the back. Um, I think I have it in the center. And then just some black heels. Um, not very exciting, but I'll show you. These are by Bellini. I've had them for a while. So yeah, that's my outfit of the day. Oh, and last but not least, I did use the Urban Decay All Nighter. Um, I think I showed you guys in the haul that I got the little one of that. So this is the full one. I use that usually when I know, like I said, I have golf tonight. So when I have a lot going on and want my makeup to last without having to touch it up. So anyway, I hope you guys have a great day. I'm sorry if this seems like I've been doing a lot of videos. I just wanted to do some of the ones that I promised I would do. So I'll stop for a while, maybe. <laughs> are sick of seeing me. Uh, anyway, I hope you guys have a great day. Uh, it is a beautiful day here in Wisconsin. I hope you guys are having some nice weather uh, where you live. So I will talk to you guys soon. Bye. Thanks for watching. I always forget to say that, but I do mean it. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.